Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel. Today we have an interesting puzzle in front of us. Now, this is part of a series. I think this is the fourth one of this particular series. I'm not going to do all of them. I, I saw it. I saw a couple of them out here. Um, this is the one I'm going to take a look at first just to see what's going on. But it's called um, Wonderland. I think it's um, Winter Wonderland. And this is the fourth one. And it's like, I can't remember the... the, the uh, the abbreviation for what all that meant. But anyway, doesn't really matter. This one's called Wonderland. It's the fourth of a series of them. It's by Belg. And uh, let's just take a look at the rules, see what's going on. So it's normal Sudoku. So every row, column, and three by three box, excuse me, will have the digits one through nine once each. Now, digits on thermos strictly increase from bulb to tip. So this guy here, we actually have a couple of given digits. So you're the low digit, you're the high digit. This is going to increase as it goes up in this direction. Same for all these other guys. Then we have digits on a purple ren band line must form a set of non-repeating consecutive digits in the order. We see the little tail end of one ren band over here. So we know that this is going to be part of a ren band line where they're going to just be consecutive digits. What else we got? Uh, Jason did not a green German whisper line. Mess differ by five, so we don't see those yet. But let's say there was a German whisper line here. I mean, this digit and this digit have to at least be five away from each other, and so on and so forth down the line. Then we've got minimum cells. So digits in a minimum cell smaller than the digits in the four adjacent, or four possibly adjacent. This is a min cell because we have the arrows pointing in, so this digit must be lower than all of these digits. And that's three of them because on the edge there. We also have digits and cells set by white dots are consecutive. So that's part of our crop key set. I guess there's only the white ones, not the black dots. So these two here will be consecutive. And then finally, part of the grid is covered in fog. As correct digits are placed, some fog will clear, revealing additional clues. There is always enough information in the revealed portion of the grid to place another correct digit without guessing. Digits can be placed within the fog. So I don't know if that means this is dynamic or it's uh, regular. We'll find out as we move along here. But if we were to figure out a digit here, this uh, cell would clear of its fog and then maybe something else will clear as well. We'll find that out once we get into it. So all that said, let's jump into it. Links in the description below. Let's have some fun. All right. So where are we going to start? Well, we've got to use the information we have, right? So this has to be a lowish digit, either one or three, because it has to be less than four, can't be two. Now, we can probably put some values. That can't be a seven. This could be six, seven, can't go to eight, sevens, eights, and nines. I wasn't expecting that to do much. This is either seven or nine. Um, and then, of course, these guys just have to be larger than one or three. Um, that just means one of these two. Oh, duh, there it is. Didn't see that. The eight, where does it go? Easy question right here. Okay, so this must be dynamic fog because we didn't clear anything out with that given di or that digit correctly placed. One of these will be an eight. Um, can we think about? Eh, I was gonna say ones. One of these two will be a one. Let's start thinking about what some of these options maybe could be. Because again, this has to at least. Well, this has to at least be a five, doesn't it? Because let's say this was a one. Well, oh no, this could be a three. It has to at least be a three. That's the correct uh, thing to say. So obviously this is not a one. This is not seeing things very quickly here already. It's not a good sign. Uh, three, five, six, and that's as high as that'll go. This could be four, five, six, or seven. One of these two is going to be a nine, so therefore it goes here. Now we get some clearance. That tells us this has to be the seven and six. You can't be a six. Good. Uh, this guy here has to be less than these guys. Can't be one. Could be two or three. I guess we could still have either one of those working at this point. One of these will be a nine. Put those in. And this guy really doesn't say much of anything until we can figure out what this Ren band does. Because it can just be three, five, six, or seven. 
with no restriction whatsoever from the thermo. Okay, is there anything else? You can't be seven. Is there anything at or six? Hello? Okay, that means you can't be the five. You are the three. You are a two. That's going to clear more info. That tells me you're not a three. Five, six, and seven. One of these will be a seven, so that pushes a seven up here with the eight. This can't ever be an eight. This is a one. One of those two will also be a one. Let's maybe start thinking about what these guys can be because we have the limitations here. So five and seven, that's it. Okay. Yeah, so then this is seven or eight, and then this has to be eight or nine, and it can't be eight, so it's nine. That forces you to be nine, and then because of that crop key, we can now say this is the eight. You're not. What about any of these other guys? Do we have anything else staring down the gun here? The four says you are the five. That's gonna give us the six and the seven and the five, okay. This then has to be a three. Hey, we get a little bit of a, looks like a, a pine tree here. Uh, let's try to fill in the rest of this information first though. One and four, these guys will be three and six. You'll be the five, seven pair. And we can't determine yet what that is. Okay, let's get on to you. You can't be a six anymore because these are German whispers. Because these would both have to be ones. They can't be. Three and six. Let's get rid of this stuff real quick. These are going to be an eight, nine pair because of the three. This is the eight. This is the nine. These have to be consecutive. One, two, three, four, five, and six, I think they could all get up to. And actually, this is, I didn't even notice it again. This is a min. So it has to be below three, because all of these have to be higher than this. This one can't be a one. Uh, it still doesn't really reduce, oh, well, I guess it gets rid of the six, doesn't it? Because this has to at least be lower than the three, so we can't ever get up to a six. Now, of course, this can't be a five, and it can't be a four, so it's a two, one, four. Okay, making it harder than it needs to be. Surprise, surprise. Um, these guys all have to be high. Let's put them all in and then remove the options. Not six or nine, not eight or nine. And can we do anything else? We can. This can't be a six, so it's the seven, eight, seven. Now we've got some interesting bits. It looks like maybe this is the side of a tree we're just seeing out of the picture frame. Could be. That seven gets us the five and the seven here. Mm. Oh, it's good tea. One, two, and three, which means these are six, sevens, eights, and nines, and you can't be seven, eight, or nine. That's a six. That's a one. One. Why did it hit that? Go away. Goodness gracious. It's being a pain. Go away sixes and sevens. This actually is just an eight, nine. You are, what, a three and a five, it looks like which forces you to be a four. It gives us a little bit more information. I'm assuming since this opened up, we can't do anything else over here just yet, so let's maybe start thinking about what could be happening in here. Because we know this is at least a three-cell Ren band now. It has a five on it. It can't have a nine or an eight, but we could also branch off at some point, so we can't say this is the only place this goes. The question's going to be, we have an easier way to look at it. German Whisper. These two have to be either both high or both low. They can't both be high. So these are one, threes, and fours, because we can't use two. This guy can't be six, seven, or eight, so he is nine. That gives us more trees. Okay. And we can tell what these guys are. They are six, seven, and eight going to tell us these guys are ones, twos, threes, and fours. You're not fours. Actually, none of you are fours. And you guys can't be threes. We do get one, two, three trips going along here. wonder if that tells us anything or not. Don't quite know. Oh, we do know there's a two 
because of this region, so these can't have twos on them. So this is some one three pair, which means one of these two has to be the eight, so you're not. One of these has to be a two, so one of these has to be the remaining seven. Perfect, this is a seven eight, this is the six. Now it's gonna open up a lot of stuff. This looks like it's a present and it does actually veer off. Okay, well then. Let's go into here, because we have givens, or not givens, but we have certain options that can only go there. Four, sixes, and nines. You are the nine. You guys aren't. And the six says you are the four and the six. The six here does not say that's a one. I almost mistook that for a German whisper line. It's not a one, though. And... I guess we can't say which one of these is which just yet. But I guess we can get on to the highs and lows. Twos, threes, and fours. You can't be fours. So this is a two, three pair. You have to be an eight. That five actually just says this is three and four. Was that there or that got cleared? I think that got cleared because I didn't see it previously. We said one of these was the two. The four actually says you're not. Yeah, I don't think we have the information there just yet. We do know there has to be a 7 on this row, though, and it can't be in any of those. And you then have to be the 1. Okay, there's more info. Do we just go down here? Or do we start to look at Sudoku more? One of those, one of those, no... We'll see if we can find something here. Maybe we just need to look at this Renban. Five, six, four, three. Yeah, there can't be a one on this Renban. That's what I should have seen. One, two, three, four, five digits only. And we have a five and a six already. So the lowest we can get down to is a two. So this is a four, three, two, three, one. And this is the one. Okay, there we go. This is now a given for two. It looks like we're really just into Sudoku now. We might not even have more clearance going on. What are you? I think you're a 9. Gives us the 8 and the 9. Doesn't tell us which one of these are yet. You guys are what? 1, 2, 5, 6, and 7s. You're not a 5. You're not a 6. I guess we'll just go through these guys. 3, 6, 8. Not 8. Not 6. Actually, this is not... These are not threes. Again, we had this these trips down here, I just remembered. Uh, so this is eight, this is six, this is three. They give us a six here. And uh, the eight, yeah, there we go. The eight over there, I just, again, didn't quite see it. What are you two? Two and a four, so this is the two, this is the four. These have to be from sevens and nines, so you're the seven, you're the nine. Yep, five, seven. You have to be, what, a five. Okay, let's figure out how these guys are going to work then. And what am I not seeing here? Oh, the seven and the three. I was like, there has to be something here. That's the one, two, one, three, two, three. There we go. Yeah, NKSA 2025. I didn't, couldn't remember what this was, um, but congratulations right there. Uh, that's obviously in German, which I don't speak very well or at all, really. So <laughs> I can understand some very random things. But that's about it. Anyway, uh, it was a fun puzzle. I hope you all enjoyed that one. It was good for the season because we are getting into winter time here at least. For some of us, I know some of you down in the uh, uh, the south there are going into summertime, but it's getting chilly up here a little bit. So anyway, it was a fun puzzle to do and kind of getting into the season. So hope you all enjoyed that one. I did as well. And uh, we'll see you next one. Thanks a lot.